Hi, so today we're going to be discussing this case. So let's read the case. A family comes in with a six-year-old boy presenting with the inability to talk, severe intellectual disability. Now we are going to be covering a couple of um, genetic diseases which actually have predisposition to intellectual disability and this child has ataxic gait. What does it mean by ataxic gait? Well, gait is kind of the way you walk. An ataxic gait is having involuntary movement. Sorry. Involuntary, uncoordinated movement. Now let's keep reading on. The child has a happy mood. Now that's really important. When children present with a happy mood, and the next thing is even more important, random bursts of laughter. Random bursts of laughter. Now, immediately this should ring a bell. Uh, there's one particular genetic disease, which uh, is also known as, you've read the title, so you kind of already know which one it is, but so this presents with, it's known as happy puppet syndrome and yeah this should give it away straight away random bursts of laughter or unmotivated laughter okay mother report sorry the EEG findings are normal however the mother reports that he only sleeps 5 to 5.5 hours per night okay what is this disease this is Angelman Angelman syndrome. Okay, what really gave it away for me was the happy happy mood and combined with these random bursts of laughter. Now sometimes you do expect abnormal EEG findings and that is because these patients will often have seizures. These patients will often have oh, seizures. Okay, so Angelman syndrome is also known as happy puppet syndrome. This is when these kids are presenting with happy moods and these random bursts of laughter. It is a micro deletion syndrome combined with genomic imprinting. Now in a absolute nutshell let me tell you what genomic imprinting is genomic imprinting is when certain genes or parts of genes are silenced and these are silenced due to dna modifications now we are aware of certain dna modifications like methylation and that's a way of making the dna so 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 condensed that it's not able to be transcripted making the dna so so condensed by adding these methyl groups that ch3 that's what i'm trying to do making the dna so condensed that it's not able to be actually transcribed as easily and since that doesn't happen that is known as genomic imprinting or silencing now the what happens in angel man syndrome m for maternal so here you have maternal deletion maternal deletion now you have something called prada willi syndrome which we'll cover later on and that is a, a disease in which you have paternal deletion now one thing to clear angelman syndrome occurs due to a maternal deletion maternal deletion in the u b e 3 a allele Okay, and it happens in the same Prada Willi slash Angelman's critical region, if you want to get all genetic genetics about it. This looks like a mess. Okay, so now these people, pay, people with Angelman syndrome, th these kids, they do have quite severe intellectual disability. 
but at the same time this happy puppet syndrome they do can present with seizures and these seizures can be quite dangerous eventually it depends on how how much of the gene is you know really deleted so um now if this is a maternal deletion this means that there is paternal imprinting look for look out for my video on genomic imprinting to make more sense of all of this now also insomnia another symptom here that we forgot to talk about is insomnia these patients also have insomnia okay now i remember the ube3a allele if it's ube3a gene if it's important for you and remember that this can also this disease can also arise by another genetic mechanism known as uniparental disomy uniparental disomy which would occur from the paternal side so it would be paternal uniparental disomy which is just a fancy way of saying that both kind of chromosomes come from the father and therefore you don't even need a deletion of the mother mother's ub3 because both are coming from the father none of it's coming from the mother you don't even need it to be deleted because in the first instance you're not even getting it okay hope that was helpful like and subscribe